What's up everyone, it's your boy Richard Wong, aka RW, back with another video and today we're going to do a tutorial, haven't done a tutorial in a while and I know you guys see the title of the video and I know what you guys are here for so I'm going to save all my plugs and my links and stuff like that for the end of the video. For now, let's just get right into it, ghost notes and logic, let's go. Alright, so here's the session, we're in the session, Um, this is a beat that was on one of my previous beat making videos, I'll put up a card right now if you guys want to watch it, but... I know what you guys are here for, you want the ghost melodies, but let's play this out first real quick so you know what we're working with. Yeah, you know, just a simple melody right there. Um, I actually do have a flute melody already on it, but for the sake of the video, no flute melody. But let's say now we want to add a flute melody to this, but we don't. You know, we're not. Our music theory isn't the best, and we kind of want it to line up with the exact notes. That way, we know it's gonna sound good. FL Studio can do this. You know, when you're working with um certain certain instruments in the background, it'll show the MIDI from other instruments that you already played. But I'm gonna teach you guys how to do that in Logic. I feel like not a lot of people know about this because I haven't really seen much of it. But this is what I like to do. First, I'm gonna highlight everything. Click L. It's gonna loop everything over. And now, on this. The second one, not the first one, but the second one, create an empty MIDI region, stretch that out to how obviously the length you want it. Command U, get that over there, and now you highlight whatever you want to be the ghost notes. So I want these keys to be the ghost notes to my flute. So I do that, highlight the flute, double click, bam. Let's just scroll right over and you'll have the ghost notes. So now you can put that. Flute however you want, it'll line up. Oh, the flute doesn't go that high. But you see what I mean. You pretty much can do this, and obviously you can highlight it all. Just bring down an octave; it's still gonna line up. So you can do whatever you want with it. You can just keep doing. It. But let me warn you guys: don't click Command A to highlight everything because it will highlight all the notes. So, and obviously you don't want to highlight all the notes. If you say you want to move something over, say you want this all of it to shift over. Don't click Command A because it's going to shift everything over. Just drag and highlight. And that's how you do it. That's honestly it. It's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. And you can do that with any track. And then what I like to do is say this is it. That's the flute melody you want. Obviously, it's not. But for the sake of the video, just you know, make it fast. What I like to do is, bam, drag this over. Highlight everything again. Hit L again. And we're back. And obviously, Command U. And that's how you get ghost notes and logic. Simple as that. But yeah, that's me for this one. Thank you all for watching. Uh, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment. Let me know exactly what you think. What other videos you want to see from me. Tips, trips, tutorials, and stuff like that. Just let me know. And also subscribe for more videos. And also check me out on Twitch. I uh, make beats live. Play new music. And uh, stuff like that. You can see the tips and tricks right there. Um, give me a follow on there, you know, I'd be streaming about three times a week. I do have a different stream schedule every week. I'm gonna, you know, post something on my Instagram, my Twitter, my stream schedule for that week. And speaking of Instagram, follow me there as well, at Mr. RW, where I post a bunch of mini beat making videos. And it's also the best place to be up to date with what I'm doing. It's where I'm most active besides YouTube. And also, um, what else do I got? Oh, if you guys want to collab with me, I do have a free sample pack out now. Link in description. Um, my Twitch link's going to be down there as well. And Instagram, actually. Everything's down there. <laughs> but I release a new sample pack every time we hit a milestone. The upcoming milestones are 3,000 followers on Instagram, 1,000 followers on YouTube. And as long as we hit one of those, I release a new sample pack for free, of course. And uh, if we hit both, that's two sample packs. So every time a milestone is hit, new free sample pack. So definitely follow, definitely subscribe. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for listening. See you guys next time. Peace.